for company value. Right. So it also depends on what metrics we're using, right? <laughs> Prove worthiness ratings like these. Well, yeah, that's the thing is like. Eh. Um, so I try to be more specific is better. If possible. <laughs> Because obviously, if you say that a company has, if you say, like, this company is a AAA company, people are going to immediately go, well, why can't they fix everything? Why can't they do everything? Because they, they have probably 5,000 employees, right? Like, all right, well, but that's not really, that's not really an honest um, assessment of... What a, what a company could possibly be, right? If you say it's a double-A company, the people are going to be more like, oh, okay. So they don't have... They don't have 5,000 employees. 10,000 employees or whatever. It gives you a better... idea of what you're, what you're looking at by the use of language. Why are we having such a long convo about batteries, though? Everybody knows that triple A's are smaller than double A's, so now we just confused everything. Ah. Records. Certain problems don't get fixed fast just because there's more employees either. Yeah, well, that's, that's the other thing, too. Like, um, there are definitely some issues with the Total War engine that you could have freaking a million employees and probably you would not be able to fix it without like being like, okay, we're gonna take some of these million employees and we're gonna rewrite a bunch of big chunks of the engine, right? Things like that. <laughs> like the door glitch. I don't think the door glitch can be fixed without rewriting chunks of the engine, more than likely. Otherwise it would have fixed it by now. Unless CA just hates us, which I suppose is possible. CA could just hate us, and they don't want to fix. They want to fix stuff for us. CA definitely hates you. You individually. Goblins! Whatever! Whatever! Gobbo's rule! Okay. You need to not do this. You need to do this. There towards that. Let's do this. Try to get shit hit these gyro bombers as well. Trying to run some giant spiders up here. Freaking cannons, though, man. Yeah. Get it, kill 
Back it up here. Try to interject a spider into this. We can. I had the range units in my range units. Oh, that was going on over here. Get up in there, boys. We need your fodder. Freaking explosions. Up those rangers. Where's my caster at and all this? If I get another foot of work, I do. Try to foot on that shit. They're freaking criminy. Oh, there's Belagar. Ow! The war flows in me. You guys back in here. Guys, into that. Yeah, all right. Get him, giant spaduders. Get him. You guys, up here. We get these trolls going back in here. I think we're. I think we're getting it. This is friggin' close as shit, that's for certain. Deal with Belagar, this big problem. Send a spider over here to help punch Belagar in the face, I think. Some organ guns up here still giving us hell. Running! We is better than them! Shoot them! Moving fast! Run, boys! Run, boys! That Belagar still in the middle here? Yeah, it's Belagar. Shoot you guys up on here. Let's have you guys shoot these iron drakes. Cannons, get on top of those. You guys get back up in there. Continue fighting. Do not stop fighting. That's why we came here. This stinks. You are greenskins. You will fight to the end. Of time, that is. Uh, have there been any previews or spoilers of the Wild DLC? Not that I'm aware of. Um, they just said it's coming in December. 
So at least we have that now. At least we have that now. Also, uh, Macludo78, thank you for that follow. Hope your day is going well. Let's grab! Let's get stubby! My black orcs are fucked. I think these guys might actually be these guys might be straight dead, honestly. There's only four of them left. Only four of them left. Reading that I can see a misconception issue. I do not see an issue if they have an opt-out. Uh, retribution if they say yes they get compensated for extra time so they give company profit actually ones who worked for it shrug uh, okay that's uh, cyber some shit about cyber, cyberpunk right oh yeah i mean cd project red is not they're not saints for sure i mean they're doing a might bit better than some of the companies out there these days but they're certainly not certainly not like freaking perfect by, by far they still suffer from uh video game company culture which is pretty toxic in a lot of cases most cases if it comes to december they should include a skin pack for do through and the entry on boys make our christmas pine trees do you supply for your museum job hey well good luck Hopefully you get it. How many kills of these things yet? Yeah. Freaking doomed ever catapults. Coming in clutch, honestly. Also a couple pretty solid foot of gorks. I may have lost multiple black orcs here. We'll see. As long as I save the army, that's the big thing. I can pull this army back and heal it. That's not big a deal. A job that is relevant for my degree? Insane. Not possible. Yeah, okay. My black orcs did not fare well, but neither did his army, so that's good. Did Belagar actually die there? I think we might have actually killed Belagar in that too, which is nice. Yeah, we did. No. Yeah, we did. I will not shame my clan. He done went and died. All right, so we're going to go back up here. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I'm going to get my ass out of there, but that was pretty that was pretty worth for us. That was two That was two pretty spooky armies right there. Worf. Magic and uh, black orcs can be rebuilt in one turn due to this lovely building here. Enemy nah, no, not that one. This lovely building here. I eat flesh. So you can actually build them at a speed, which is Let's conducive to, like, utilizing them properly. It's crap and hasn't changed anything in 20 years. I've been going there, but still, I don't want to have to dig holes. Oh, and it's almost bankrupt. Lovely. Never mind companies that are untouchable either. I never company that is only good. No, yeah, no kidding, right? So, I'm not against, like, giving companies props for doing things that are not like stupid though right if you got a company that's doing things more right than other companies you should probably pat them on the back and be like all right keep that up the wall. don't let them get away with everything obviously at that point but you should uh congratulate companies for doing the right thing and then obviously condemn them for doing the wrong things
Because otherwise, if you, all you do is condemn them all the time, then clearly they're not. They're just gonna be like, "Well, we're gonna get shit on anyway, so we'll just do whatever, right?" <laughs> if it's not gonna give us, if it's not gonna give us any positive PR, then because again, it's a company, and the company, like positive PR, is marketing for the company, right? Negative PR is the reverse. And if you're gonna get negative PR, you might as well at least have it be a positive for your bottom line. Rolling down to the Torka here. Everything. Kill everything. Twelve K on the sack. Yeah, sounds good. Something I can get behind. All right. That was another really good change. The uh, rating stance takes no movement. Really, really nice. Negative AK. Yeah, you know. These things happen. When you're at war with literally, literally everyone. <laughs> I am a rune lord, not some smith. Uh, do, 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 do. Okay, we're good there. Um, is there anything else I really need to do here? Oh yeah, I need to check, make sure I am at war with literally everyone again. There we go. We are indeed. And what do we got here? No, not now. Okay. Not, is not super concerned about that. I'll just let that happen. And yeah. We're negative 7.7k actually. <laughs> actually. Cat decided to take over my lap. I want food. Do I be an asshole disturber? Or suffer and let her sleep? Suffer. Alright, we gotta... This is just gonna have to happen. I can't do anything about that. Proper. I actually killed way more guys in, in the auto calculate than we would've in, if we actually fought it out, to be totally honest. Which is... I did not expect to get to that much damage. That's pretty surprising. Wake her and tell her it's Murph's fault. <laughs> Listen here, cat. I've got some bad news. <laughs> some dude on the other side of the world has ruined your sleep. Not a terrible idea. Okay. Well, I knew this was going to happen, but that's fine. They're probably not going to capture it anyways. Nah, yeah, they're just going to sack it again. Right. I just need to get my armies together so I can unifiedly push. I, this area here, like, has, there's so much movement you can do through here, it's insane. Like, it's amazing sometimes, like, how far factions can move through certain areas. Particularly, like, if you have areas uh, that are, like, freaking the jungle or something, you can move, like, two feet. But apparently, from you can get from, like, there all the way all the way down south because it's kind of, like, an open-ass area. Meanwhile, Helm and Gorst is doing something. Nobody knows what. Just Gorst things, apparently. First thing I learned in the chat was it's Murr's fault. Everything. <laughs> of course, Murph is like the patron saint of the channel, so, you know. 
It's kind of like sh it's kind of like shaking your fist at God, right? Don't let him don't let him know I said that. Get a big head. <laughs> Kiss the Dark Lord's sour straight edge blade. <laughs> I'm a product of the system. There are a lot of Imperial guys just walking around over there. Like, a lot of Imperial guys just walking around over there. Just everybody's on holiday, apparently. Well, that's good for me, actually. Top Knot's losing settlements. Is good thing. That is a positive thing for me. And my settlement's dead. All right, whatever. It's fine. I think I'm just gonna leave it that way. Then I'll double back with my army here and head into the green or head into the blizzard mine again. Another under city. Where? Oh, okay. Let's get rid of that, shall we? All right. Let's do that real quick. Ask another. Let's try to get army block here. Yes. Success, good. Let's cleanse corruption. Ew, I guess uh, conviction. Why not? Go steal technology from the Redneck Hills. Continue stealing technology. What I like to know is why we haven't stolen the, pro the stolen the plans for like gyrocopters yet. Been stealing dwarf tech forever now. We've learned nothing. Literally nothing. They want to ta pray at the temple of Murph and Castle Murph and Hoff. Yeah. <laughs> Look at all this crap. Impossible. No mortal. No. They're all just standing up against the wall here, <laughs> raiding me. Not likely. Yes, but Doc wants me. It's freaking ridiculous. What do you want? I just gotta find the ones that are most dangerous and army this. army block Not those likely. ones. Hawks will essentially. Yeah. Oh, there we go. I was actually surprised that succeeded. I only had 59% chance. I've been failing 70% chances like all over the place, so. Absolutely. Like, I'm not concerned about no. the freaking armies that are like You're this. Overruled. Not concerned about that. No. Ah. Hmm. Those are kind of spooky, though. Never. Hey, Cragweer finally has walls around it. Holy shit! It's my ambush I success chance out here. Sixty percent. Sixty percent. I could just go sit in Castle Murfenhoff, I guess. Legging it, plotting and scheming. See what comes my way. Mork says what? Head him down there. You assault them some more. And then you it, it will miscast. Army Body block boss. them. What do you want? Best idea yet. Let's keep chasing those guys around. 
I will not disgrace my ancestors. Oh, he's globally recruiting freaking hammerers, I see. Take me for At a rank eight. Nice. Good stuff. That's a spicy meatball. I'll ignore that. Insolence. Good. Eh, we'll just stay here and finish healing. Grab our iron hide. Yeah, it's prepared public order, probably. Yeah. Let's go. This bear leads a war. Look it back over here. This bear involves fighting. Oh, don't worry. Fighting will occur. So You. What do you want? I'll have you come oh, up I here. Come I'll have you guys head down this way. Bone this way. Pair Mayrak. Just keep having him assault people. All right, he just hit forty. Wound maker and point then thick skinned. There we go. You, oh, I got another guy that can let us go try to block this dude. I mean, we are distracting like the majority of the empire right now. <laughs> like we have the we have basically the majority of the empire sitting in our backyard. What's the landmark in Lamia? It's the... It's the gem mine. It's this. And the... Lamia itself. Which doesn't really do much for the greenskins. But yeah, it's this. Really. There's nothing else special here. Stunty mine. Let's get stabby. Oh, this guy respawned. Yeah, this dude up here. Yes, boss. We're sending, sending him down here you to help out. Me do that, boss. I can make you do whatever I want. Uh. Precise, probably. Yeah, we'll just start doing that. Landmark is not for the orcs, basically. Yeah, so the... So Lamia itself doesn't really give the orcs any bonuses. Even though it's technically like a special city or whatever. So the only bonus you get is the fact that you get the Stunty Mine. Which is a pretty big bonus. It is a thousand gold a turn. Don't get me wrong, that's pretty dope. Do you take me for the Wozniak? But I will also, not obey. Also, not anything that's like crazy good. It just falls in the category of kind of nice. Now's the time. Okay. Are these guys allied with each other? Stand before the supreme patriarch. They're defensive allies, but they're not military before. allies. You're Actually, kind of surprising. You what? All right. So once this army gets up and running, then we'll then we'll hit our wa up. Obviously, how how what's the strength on Angrens? Strength rank three currently. Okay, so wahing them would still be fairly effective. How many settlements do the top knots have left at this point? Two. Okay. Got another. Dwar More dwarves pushing me from the south. Is there no other faction at war with each other? Are they only attacking you? Ah, uh, there's a couple of factions that are still fighting each other. Like the war herds, obviously, are fighting everyone. Paravon's still fighting like Taos and Protector of the Realm. There are a couple of factions Lincoln. that are fighting like the World Walkers. Obviously Chaos. 
So there's some stuff going on there. Malekith. These guys are fighting Clan Eshin randomly. Um, I'm kind of surprised I'm not. Well, maybe it's just because I can't see the elves. Like, it is time. I can't see that they're at war with them. These guys are also fighting the top knots. So yeah, there's, there's a couple of factions that are fighting other people, but mostly it's just to me. War. Kislev. It's either just me or me and chaos. Is that Skaven shit? That is Skaven shit. Why is there Skaven crap here? There's probably a freaking Undercity and Ekrand or some nonsense. Alright. Oh, Krokgar's over here. I see. Mmm, he has lasers. Sweet. That man's got lasers. Uh, yeah. Very good. Skaven shit. That warpstone dust is is all mine to snort. Yeah, right. Snort it. Start now. Uh, well, so we're going to try to defend in these areas, really. The freaking laser dinos are going to be a big problem, or the laser dino is going to be a big problem. We have basically no range units here. Got one night goblin with silver chevron, though. So there's that, I suppose. Uh, all right. Let's take these towers for the moment. This guy's there. Try to hang out at these walls for a bit, at least. We're okay. All right, so that's that. So I'm three in here. All right. Okay, so night goblins. Goblins. Those are fanatics. We do have a good amount of fanatics, thankfully. So long as we can deal with the big dinos, the fanatics are gonna do really well. The issue is is dealing with a laser dino, because the laser dino dino has the ability to rip through a lot of our units quite quickly. Might take one of these units, put them over here, just see if we might be able to focus that thing down a bit. We'll see. Yeah, alright. Yeah, right. About as good as this shit's gonna get. Alright, let's try to focus down those hunting packs. Hopefully this thing moves within range of my range units, obviously, so I can, can light it up a bit. These things have really good arc of fire. Like the Salamander hunting packs, actually, their their freaking firing arc is insanely good when dealing with walls. Well, we're shooting at it. We are certainly not doing a lot of damage, though. Special 
Might actually be worth our time to shoot these salamanders instead. Alright, time to pull you guys back. You first. Pull these guys back as well. Oh. Okay, this is good. Honestly, that's really, really good for us that they use that there. Alright, so that's one that's one laser dinosaur shot down. Pull you guys back off the wall. Pull you guys back off the wall. Yipe, 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 yipe. Get the hell out of there. They're gonna kill us. Hey, it's over, guy. Oh, they drop all the rocks on me already? Probably. That's good, too. Oh, these guys have bolos. Ah, all right. Yeah, that's gonna be painful. I need to try to... I need to try to shoot them up. Oh, here comes the laser dino. You try to get on top of these salamanders before they tear us up. Go, go, go. Punch salamanders. Might as well throw fanatics through that. Spread these guys out as much as I can. I'll set this guy over to the left. Alright, we're getting some good damage down on these Salamander hunting packs, so that's solid. I think it's mostly my trolls that are doing damage there, though. Watch these guys moving up through here. Toss those fanatics down into that. Those are almost down. That's good. Let's push these guys up here because that's a lot of freaking source warriors. We can we can get another freaking fanatics in that. Be really, really good. Throw that down through there. That might bounce off the wall too, back into him potentially. You guys. Send you over here to help with this. Yeah, those guys are down. Send you guys over here to the left. Ah, it's almost dead. Some smart fanatics through there. Yeah, there we go. I did a nice little loop de loop. Send some guys down here to help with that. Careful here. Some fanatics through there. Oh, even more fanatics through there. And we're out of ammo, so I guess I'll just push up into here. There we go. Big Dino died. Eight seconds, 41 seconds. 
Remember, if any Dowie start in the Dark Elf corner of the map, or just the Spine of Sotek, and I have the map, it's just the Spine of Sotek over there. Yes! Lightning! Maybe fast! Go Unfortunately. Help me now. Yeah, there's really no dwarves over on that side. Goblins versus Lizardmen! Goblins will work it all day long. Not even a chance. Makes the job way easier. Why are you asking? We'll be Croc Guard down to like no health and we'll just leave him to think about what he did or did not do in this case. At least Krokgar's not on his freaking giant dinosaur yet. Thank goodness for that. I want all the Dolly areas for first my anger come in. Gotcha. Yeah, I don't think there's any dwarves in not North America. There's Ratmen. There's North Northmen. There's tricking uh, Tomb Kings. Obviously Dark Elves. Yeah, the Spy of Sotek are in Lustria. Take cash. Yeah, the last defenders are not really in a good way at the moment. Hey! Leave Marak alone. Oh, he actually captured it this time. Yeah. Oh, I'll just have to send Krokgar over there to deal with that, and... Or not Krokgar. <laughs> Grimgor. Send Grimgor over to deal with that, and then, uh... Don't mess with me! What's your messy? No. And then we can keep pushing the lizard men around. Yeah. Didn't think so, but I hadn't played Dark Elf since before the map update, so I wasn't sure. Right. Gotcha. Jeez, look at this freaking mess. That's a lot of malarkey. Okay, so one army went that way, another army came back up north. Yeah, we definitely need to have a unified front against these dwarves because, Jesus, please. They are numerous. Stalia blew my mind winning in another game back to back. Yeah, again, that's quite surprising. Like, <laughs> you don't see that very often. And the fact they did it back to back. They just had something to prove, I guess. Nope. I'm gonna defend Death Gorge. Like, turn five, knocked out Ikit. Well, if they're gonna win, they have to kill, like, Ikit quickly. Because other, otherwise, Ikit will get guns and just delete them. Telia killed Sartosa. That, I'm not too surprised if Telia does this weird thing where everyone smiles, they just freaking fly off the handle and murder everyone. I'm a lot less surprised by that sort of thing happening, for sure. I've had games where, I've had games where freaking Tilly has taken over, like, the Empire. <laughs> I haven't seen one of those in a while, to be honest, but it's happened. Like, I was just looking around, I'm like, why is the Empire dying to Tilly? What in the world? <laughs> They'll, they'll, like, go knock out the Wood Elves sometimes, too. Which is always weird as well. The thing that hamstrings Tilia these days is the fact that they're right next to Ikit. So, 
they run into pro they run into more problems than they used to because it gets there being a bastard. Same thing with Astalia. <laughs> but if they can beat them early, then then they're good. Um, let's see here. Do I want to put any anybody on the walls over here real quick? Maybe I'll take like a unit of goblins and we'll just throw them up. Because of these tomb guard, yeah, they do have some tomb guards, so we'll put some guys there on the walls to shoot those dudes. I'll call it good. He doesn't have a caster, does he? Here's this guy a caster. He's not a caster, but he does have the curse or whatever. So I gotta be aware of that. Stahl is doing great as well until they declare the Empire and all three main Bretonian factions. Aha. Yeah, it was a bit bold of them. I would say. Alright. Check these guys out. Oh no, not carrion! Ah, the carrion! Wolf riders! Gonna kill them! The lights are ready! Running! The carrion are attacking my goblins! No! Let's take my archers and take them off fire at will for right now. So I feel like they're gonna waste a lot of ammo here otherwise. Marienburg owns like half the Empire. Marienburg's been doing really well recently. Like they've perfor been performing decently overall. Against the other Empire factions. Alright, I don't think we need to use any more arrows over on this side. Probably fine. Might want to shoot some arrows at these guys, though, potentially, over on this left hand side. Just do damage over time. Damage to combatants. Yeah. So that's gonna be annoying when that goes off. We're gonna hold on to our Wa here for a brief moment as well. Yeah, he could probably summon on me too, so I have to be aware of that. This leader is eating shit, as they say, currently. Just waiting for more guys to group up over here before I do anything about this. Like, I feel like it's kind of waste to throw my stuff at. Throw my stuff at a lot of these dudes when they're just skeletal warriors, right? Okay, there we go. His his AOE damage went off. So that's done with. Finish his ass off here. This freaking carrion are not dead yet. Come on, guys. It's carrion. There we go. Now we're getting. Now we're getting some more skeletons up in here. Realm of Souls instantly goes off after I do that. I'm the boss. Oh, okay. He's, he summoned his... Summoned his Ushapti over here. Fair enough. Running. Stop him. I want my Wolf Riders at the Skeletons. Another one across here. There we go. 
All right, now let's pull this. Throw some fanatics across to these Elvideers. Enemy leader died, so that's good. Wolf Riders! Oh no, my Wolf Riders. Whatever shall I do? What a horrible thing to have happen. Alright, let's take these guys and push them in. And we'll just take you guys and put you back on fire at will. So we should be a little weapons free at this point and still have enough arrows to continue the fight. Which green con screens controls are your favorite slash best? I really like the stone trolls. Uh, because they're basically like armored trolls without all the extra freaking song and dance. And armored trolls are actually pretty darn solid. Yeah. And it's just that you don't usually build them as chaos because there's so many other good things to build as chaos. Uh, but I think stone trolls are probably the, probably the best overall. Although the swap trolls are pretty good in the early game. Because the debuff is not something that should be easily ignored at least. Or taken out of hand. But in the late game, I'm definitely building... If I build trolls, I'm definitely building stone trolls. On it. Gonna stab him! Still goes to support during the mid-game. Yeah. Like, if you have... If you've got some freaking swamp trolls, it's definitely not... It's definitely not a terrible thing, right? I think they do less damage overall, though, if I remember correctly. Like, their, their regular attack is a little bit lower than the other trolls. Yeah, if you have the full boss for this one, for the uh, stone trolls, they're pretty good. Yep. Go. Wet sack of fish versus wet or dry not sack of solid rock. <laughs> I suppose. <laughs> Fair. I just let them die when they die, I don't bother disbanding them. Yeah, that's usually what I end up doing too. I'll just be like, alright, well then. They kick the bucket, whatever. Then, then I replace them. Either replace them with something else or a freaking... Well, obviously I replace them with something else, but you know, like either something else entirely or storm trolls. We're having, like, a freaking summit of all Empire factions around Castle Burpenhoff. Apparently. <laughs> I was not aware that this was where the United Nations was meeting. Would have been awful cool of them to, like, ask me before they decide to use my my home territory for this nonsense. He's actually going to try to fight me now. I don't know if he's going to try to go at me here or if he's... Whatever. Is he actually going to attack? It's a lot of armies. No, he's not. Okay. Well, then we'll just lightning strike them. If you are not going to attack, my dear, then we will have to murder you. Should be able to auto calculate those guys off my fortification. Yeah, there goes that. It's fine though. Who? Really? Well, that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> 